The new Traverse is undiminished in size, with a wheelbase that's 2 inches longer than that of its predecessor and a full 8 inches longer than the new Acadia's, though it still shares its basic architecture with the GMC. This pays dividends for passengers, Chevrolet claims that the new Traverse provides more headroom and legroom for the second and third row riders, impressive, considering that the outgoing Traverse already had one of the most spacious cabins in its class. The cargo area shrinks compared with the old Traverse, although the new model's space behind the third row, 23 feet 3, still beats competitors such as the Honda Pilot, 16 feet 3, and the Ford Explorer. 21 feet 3. Likewise, total cargo space with all seats folded goes from 116 feet 3 down to 99 feet 3, although that figure manages to top the similarly big bone Volkswagen Atlas's 97 feet 3. Chevrolet's designers have wrapped the 2018 Traverse in sheet metal that adopts a more squared off look than its predecessor. The new front end, with a large hexagonal grille flanked by narrow headlights, mirrors that of the smaller 2018 Chevy Equinox crossover. A body color C-pillar breaks up the side glass area for a more upright, truck-like profile, and the rear end is similar to that of the Acadia, albeit with different tail lights. Under the skin, Chevrolet claims a weight savings of 351 pounds, comparing front-wheel drive base models which brings the Traverse more in line with slightly smaller competitors such as the Pilot and the Toyota Highlander. On most models, GM's familiar 3.6-liter V6 provides the motive force, and of 